Damn, we were warming up for the final and he drops that on me? Cristiano Ronaldo and Marcelo are extraordinarily close. And just before the 2018 Champions League final against Liverpool, CR7 dropped a bomb on the Brazilian player. After this game, I'm leaving. Cristiano Ronaldo's words sent a shockwave through Marcelo. His friend, his confidant, his brother. Ready to leave Real Madrid after one last final against Liverpool. Marcelo was devastated, shattered. But he and CR7 gave their all to take home the trophy and beat out Klopp's side. And they did it! In spite of an incredible match played by Loris Karius, who was absolutely unbeatable. Okay, we're joking. But seriously, has anybody heard from this guy since the game? Anyway, Cristiano Ronaldo and Marcelo achieved their final goal. They won the trophy. A few minutes after the match, Cristiano broke his news to the press. He implied he would be leaving the club. I'll talk about my future in a few days, but it's been wonderful playing with Real Madrid. Marcelo, interrogated by the Brazilian media, protected his bro. He said nothing about his intentions. I don't know. I think he'll stay. As for Real Madrid's fans, they didn't believe for a second that CR7 would leave. He's just putting pressure to extend his contract. Come on, he'll have a raise in a matter of weeks. Big mistake. A few weeks later, CR7 announced his departure for Juventus. The news shocked the world of football and broke Marcelo's heart. At home, alone with his partner, he collapsed. He was truly devastated and in shock. He cried for hours. CR7's departure deeply marked Marcelo and his partner. We were truly heartbroken when he went to Juventus. Marcelo and Cristiano had often gone out together. Their wives and kids got along perfectly. So Marcelo had an incredibly difficult time coming back from this separation. Worse than someone breaking up with you by text? Since the summer of 2018, the left back is just the shadow of himself at Real Madrid. Of course, I miss him. Cristiano was more than just my teammate. He was my friend. He might have been nominated best left back at the best. But that's honestly a joke when you look at his level for the last year and a half. By the way, can we take a second to talk about those nominations? Ramos as right back? Modric in the midfield? No Mane? No Salah? Is this a joke? <clears throat> anyway, Marcelo's level may have fallen off a lot in the last 18 months. But that's just because he's missing his friend Cristiano. He's never really recovered from those awful words spoken by CR7 during their warm-up for the Champions League Finals. And while distance doesn't always mean the end of a friendship, it seems like this time, at least, it seriously messed up the end of Marcelo's career. Unless Zidane's arrival can finally bring Marcelo back to his former glory.